Family and loved ones, we are gathered here today for the momentous occasion of Lauren Charter and Cameron C. Bisma <laughs> joining hands in holy matrimony. Lauren and Cameron's love story started four years ago in Chico, California. The two met in a traditional fashion for the 21st century. They met on Tinder. <laughs> the way that the application works is one person sends a message to another person. <clears throat> Usually they uh, state something about themselves or ask a question, and occasionally they use a pickup line. <laughs> well, in the uh, situation here with Cameron and Lauren, the first message that Lauren ever got from Cameron, Cameron asked her, when is the wedding? <laughs> that this day would come. You look so beautiful today, and you have been nothing but a supportive, loving, caring, nurturing, and genuinely amazing partner for nearly the past four years. You've shown me what a true love and being there for a person really means, and you're the best mother to our three beautiful dogs. <laughs> I can't wait to see you in a amazing mother you'll be to our actual children. <laughs> Your determination and drive inspires me to be the best person I can be to support you in our future dreams. As we open this new chapter in our lives, our future is brighter than ever and I'm the happiest man alive to be spending it with you. I love you, Lauren, to the moon and back forever and ever. I can't believe today is finally here. I've been looking forward to this day all of my life and I'm so happy to be sharing it with all of our family. I still can't believe I found my happy ending from Tinder. <laughs> I've been head over heels for you since the first day I met you. I vow to stand by your side in sickness and in health. I choose to love you and trust you for the rest of our days. I vow to be your biggest fan. I vow to keep updating our vows as we go because our one set of vows can't cover a lifetime of growing and changing with you, raising children with you, and falling more and more in love with you every day. Which is what I vow to do for the rest of my life. I can't wait for the day that I get to see you turn into a father. The way you are with your nephews warms my heart. Before you, I didn't see myself having kids, but now. Now I want to have them and be a mother, be a mother to them because I have you. There's never a dull moment in our relationship. And the next time we get to see each other, I'll be your missus. <laughs> <laughs>
Over the last four years, Lauren and Cameron have exemplified what a relationship rooted in friendship and laughter looks like. And if you ask me, any relationship with the foundation of friendship provides the greatest quality of life. Marriage is emphatically described as the forging of two souls into one. A union based off of selflessness, enduring nourishment, and love. Cameron, do you take Lauren to be your wedded wife? To live together in the holy state of matrimony? Do you promise to love her, comfort her, honor and keep her, forsaking all others, and keeping only unto her for as long as you both shall live? I do. <laughs> Good answer. Lauren, do you take Cameron to be your wedded husband, to live together in holy matrimony? Do you promise to love him, comfort him, honor and keep him, forsaking all others only unto him for as long as you both shall live? Okay. Lauren and Cameron have chosen these rings to represent the unbreakable circle of life and love. Before the people you have assembled here today, with the pledge you two have made of a lifelong commitment of love and devotion, I now pronounce you husband and wife. I think Cameron, you can kiss your wife again. <laughs> And now to everyone here, I introduce Miss Lauren and Cameron Sabismo. Lauren and Cameron have shown that together they can achieve anything, and together they achieve more than when they are apart. <laughs>